Good morning. Today is the 31st of October, and it's been a while since I've been on YouTube, but I think it's time for me to come back and talk of Christ. So I've been inspired to share my thoughts and my testimony with you um, that Jesus Christ is the Son of the living God. He's risen. He's alive. He paid the ultimate price for you and for me so that we can become as he is and so that we can grow and we can progress. And it's easy to lose track of those important things in the world that we live in because there's distractions all around and it seems like there's more and more opposition heaped upon each and every one of us every day. John 17, 3 says that this is life eternal, that they should know thee, the only true God, the one true God, and Jesus Christ, whom thou hast sent. So eternal life is knowing God and knowing his son. Well, how do you know a person? You spend time with them. You hear them. You listen to them. So just like a parent who I know my mom and my dad because, you know, I know their character. I know their expectations and I know their love for me. I know that Jesus Christ loves you. I know that he knows you. He knows you by your first name. He knows everything that you've been through and he is aware of what you're going through. He loves you. He knows what it feels like to be abandoned. He knows what, it's feel, what it feels like to be betrayed, to be mocked, to go through persecution, and to ultimately be alone. Some of his last words is, were, Father, why have you forsaken me? And sometimes we feel forsaken. But I testify to you that God has not forsaken you. The teacher is usually silent during the test. Fear not, for I am with thee. It's his promise. And he repeats that over and over in the scriptures. I want you to know that the Lord loves you. He cherishes you. You are a son or a daughter of the Most High, of the Creator of the universe, and nothing will separate you from His love. And I share this witness with you in the holy name of Jesus Christ. Amen.